What's up everybody, this is Jinx, welcome back to the channel and our continuing free play adventures in LEGO The Lord of the Rings. The last time we were together, we free played the last three levels of the game. So all levels have been free played. Now, um, in the last level that we free played, which was Mount Doom, I had left behind a mini kit. And uh, where that was, if you guys remember um, when we jumped into the little alcove with Gimli and used his axe, it made a sound, but we couldn't see what we picked up. And so I just assumed that it had given us whatever it was we were supposed to get. It hadn't. Actually, what it does is when you break that tile, a mini kit falls onto um, like a little raft type thing in the lava below you. So you actually have to jump down onto that raft to pick up the mini kit. So we did everything we were supposed to do to unlock the mini kits. We just didn't actually pick that one up. So that's where it was missed. So you can see now that we actually have 180 mini kits. And you'll also see that our stud count jumped up. Um, that's because when you get your final on the last level, when you get the last of the mini kits, instead of like a shower of blue studs, you get a shower of purple studs. So just finishing that last level and getting the last mini kit jumped us up like almost two and a half billion studs. And if you're playing through for the first time or you're on a trophy hunt, there is actually a trophy for collecting 10 billion studs. So, um, fairly easy way to do it if you, if you follow along and you break stuff as much as possible until you get your stud multipliers turned on and then the rest of it will kind of fall into place. So anyway, let's go ahead and look at the map. All levels have been free played. We have a few areas left to explore. And then we have some stuff to forge and deliver. So I think I think we were on Isengard. We started to explore Isengard. And then uh, we ran out of time. So let's hop over here. And I will use a strength character real quick to get us in. Alright, so we do have his armor that we can deliver, we'll do that, I guess we'll do that before we, uh, we also have that, hmm. alright, I'm going to travel over here to Helmsteep so I can be close to the horse. We're going to try this race again. Yeah, I think running out of time is exactly what it was. I was just taking too much time looking for the next uh, brick. Alright, so now we got that one. And now we need to go over the hill so we can get back. Well, maybe we don't need to go over the hill. Maybe we can just... Yeah, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Here you go, dude. You're welcome. <laughs> All right. So we have not forged those yet. Nighttime. Nighttime. All right. Well, since we have a few things at night, let's do that first. Really, with the door again. 
Good grief, why is this? understand why it's not counting. I've definitely killed ten. We're gonna try this again. Oh, good lord. but maybe using the magic sword was like knocking them so far away that by the time they counted they were too far away to count uh, I don't know that was really weird anyway let's find Grima <laughs>
couple of these chests or, or a couple of these bricks are going to be climbing the tower, so we'll get to those a little bit later. Okay, turn the crank. What do we got? All right. Another crank. And this one is missing its crank. So. <laughs> oh, Sam, can you dig for me, buddy? missing crank. Okay, we still gotta move that center one. Use a rope. There we go. Puzzle solved. He's at the very top of the tower, and these two are as we are climbing the tower. And this can be a total pain in the butt. But, fingers crossed that we can do this the first time. so good. Now we need someone who can go through there. I'm going to use Gollum. No. Gollum. Just because I knew that that wall was there. Now. Ah! Uh, you see what I mean? You see what I mean? Darn it. Okay, let's try this again.
actually. I can't use him, so let's switch back to... No. No! No! Oh. Really? See, I didn't do that. That was not my fault. And this is why this tower gets so frustrating, because things like that happen that shouldn't happen, and it's like, really... Frustration, it is real. Okay, now, there's a brick down this side. But we'll have to climb all over again, so I think we're going to wait to get that one. Bought Saruman. <laughs> now, did we get the other one? I'm not sure. Darn it, we didn't. I thought we would get it as we fell, but apparently we did not. having to do this again, but it's okay, we did it once, we can do it again. was close. <coughs> oh, 
Okay, so I can see it down there. The question is, what is the best way huh? to get to it? So the only thing left is a, a quest, which qu oh, the uh, the boots, which we don't have yet. So we are done in Isengard. So the next place would be Minas Tirith, and we're mostly done in Minas Tirith as well. Um, oh, we do have a lot of bricks to collect still, but... I believe we still have a character to buy at the top of this tower, so let's do that first. Come on. everything inside the citadel. We can deliver his greaves while we're here. Thank you. You're welcome. Alright guys, I'm going to split that one there and we'll be right back.